So hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is David with Mission the Muscle, and yeah, I did it again. <laughs> I told you guys after my nuclear power run, I was going to run a turkesterone product that interested me. I was intrigued by this turkesterone product because of all the research that I've done over this time when I've been trying to do videos and deliver information for you guys. Honest information. So just so you know, Nuclear Power by Peak Performance Labs, and the owner agrees with me, it's not a magic pill, it's not a whole pill, it's got ectosterone, ectosterone in it, it's got uh, Epicat, and it's got Laxogenin, but with proper diet and nutrition, it did help me, if you watched the last video, on quite a few things. So I was very impressed with that, and it is something that I would definitely run again. So I, I liked that product, but... It's hard to find, so it's out of stock. They, they get a bunch of them and they just sell out rapidly because it's a good product. So I wanted to do a turkesterone run, this particular turkesterone, because of the interest of the, the uh, proprietary blend and where this was sourced at. So the information that I have accumulated over the time since turkesterone has been kind of hyped up, ever since Derek first brought it out, I was checking into it because the reason why is because ectosteroids in general have been around for a while. Uh, Universal's been using them for a long time. They've had a Juga in their products for a long time, a small amount. They've had 20-hydroxy uh, ectosterone in their products for a long time. So it's been around. It's not a new ingredient. So me being the skeptic i was i ran a few products if you guys look back on my videos you see a few i ran uh, nutribios tocesterone i ran german pharma tocesterone to give you guys on it an honest take on this and being a type 1 diabetic i don't i don't jump into anything with a placebo type effect i don't expect anything to work so when I jump into something, I'm not sitting negative. I just 52 years old. There's a lot of things as a type one diabetic I go through. I go through aches, I go through pains, I go through lack of energy. I go through a hard time of maintaining and keeping muscle because my sugars are always crazy. My cortisols are my cortisol is always crazy. So there's a lot of things that I have to take in effect. I don't regret my type one diabetes at all because it has grounded me and taught me discipline and that's what a lot of things in life as we get broken down in life and we look for the growth factor out of those things that are trying to tear us down that discipline that courage is just strengthens us and i don't regret any of that because it has made me a better person all in all so the reason why this interested me is because there are there are tocesterones on the market, a ton of them, and some of them are sourced from different places. So you got the source from China, and then you got the source from Uzbekistan, and you got some source, I think, in the US. And all the research I've done is the Uzbekistan tocesterone, or Ajuga tocesterianca plant, is supposed to be the high quality plant because where it grows the atmosphere the soil and this and that it doesn't just deliver tocesterone but it delivers other ectosteroids as well so the you're getting not just an extract of tocesterone but you're getting other ectosteroids which there's probably 10 plus or minus other ectosteroids out there in the extract and no other company out there has listed this in their products so anyways i'm going way too long without showing you the product we have the one that I'm talking about is High Tech Pharmaceuticals Turkesterone 650. I'll put the ingredient profile right in front of me here so you guys can kind of understand what I'm talking about as far as how they're breaking this down pretty much. So this is a one tablet at 650 milligrams of Uzbekistan Ajuga Turkestianka extract and it's 10% turkesterone, that's 65 milligrams of turkesterone and 50% ectosteroids. I have not seen any, any other product out there breaking down the extract like that. So I had to run this for you guys. And uh, this is a, I don't know if I mentioned this, but this is a two pill or four pill. You max four pill, minimum two pills. It's just one pill twice a day or it's two pills twice a day. I went right into the two pills. So I've been running this only for 15 days. My experience on this. 
so far at 15 days, which is a short, short period of time. I just wanted to come on here because I know there are a lot of you out there looking for those extra gains. And um, if I can deliver information and turn you onto a product to help you in the gym, I'm definitely going to do my best and be honest with you too. So, I mean, if I want you to stay away from something, I'm not, I'm going to be honest on me like that and do much at all. So as you guys know, I ran other testosterone products and um, wasn't too happy with them. I think nuclear uh, power was been the best product so far that I've ran for muscle preservation and strength and stuff in 30 days. So I got off of the nuclear power by P Performance Labs. And in that product, I'll let you can go watch the review if you want to put a link up at the top. But I had some recovery and strength gains. So two weeks on that, actually my strength went up. And it didn't keep keep climbing on off through the 30 days. It went up and then it slowly climbed um, to the end of the 30 days. Just like tad bits. I'm talking increments. So it peaked and then it kind of like leveled out. So I jumped on this right afterwards, four pills a day for 15 days. And what I've noticed is my strength is still there and it's climbing a little bit. So, and the way I tell that is my sets, my reps, because I train to build muscle and overall strength in my body. So I don't sit there and uh, do, I don't do PRs. I don't do anything, especially at 52 years old, but I slow reps down. Uh, I work on the eccentric I work on the uh, concentric uh, portion of the movements. And overall, my strength is increasing in increments on 15 days. Very small. Recovery, being a type 1 diabetic, recovery is always an issue with me. I mean, it sucks, but it's like I said, it's all growth for me. Recovery has jumped up a little bit from the peak performance labs. Now, if I would have continued taking that, I don't know if the same thing would have happened. But just, I'm just we're, we're talking about this product right now. So recovery has gotten better. One thing I did notice on this is oh, I live on a third floor. And when I get home, you know, I got a dog that uh, Penny, Penny the pug, she's the cutest little thing. And she, of course, my, my wife got her some buttons where she pushes a button when she wants to go potty. And she goes up and she'll push it when she got to go potty. And it just depends on who wants to go down those three flights of stairs to take her potty. And when, when it's when it's me and my turn to do it, <laughs> I say me and my turn, I notice that going up and down the stairs later at night for me, especially training in the morning, working during the day and coming home and working on a computer and stuff like that, my sugars start to get irregular towards the end of the night, especially because that's when I'm eating most of my food and most of my carbs. Um, I'm achy and I don't have that endurance, that muscle endurance. And what I've noticed on this is the muscle endurance has been up going up and down those stairs later at night. So I not noticed it, it's noticeable that the endurance is there. So in the gym, I am so wound up. It's either pre-workouts, uh, caffeine or music that's wound me up. That sometimes I can't tell if I'm getting more muscle endurance or if it's just me just being enthused and just like into the workout because I like to kill it. And that's just my mentality. If I didn't have the gym, I'd have to have a punching bag because I got so much inside of me <laughs> that needs to come out and I let it out in the gym. So that's just that's my release. That's my holy place. So just wanted to come on here real quick and let you guys know about this product. I have no discount codes for you guys. I wish I did. Uh, so you guys can save a little money. I'll put a link down below of the place that I got it from. And it's pretty much the best price. It's from Get Yoked. But once again, High Tech Pharmaceuticals, Turkesterone 650. Very good quality product of Turkesterone and a, everything I've researched. It is where it's supposed to come from and how it's supposed to be extracted as far as all the ingredients. So this is Dave. I hope this helped. If it did and you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, so I'll be back for more, trying more products and delivering you guys some information. I'm going to get going. We'll see you guys next time on the channel.